Welcome to Weeping Willow Homestead. Today I have a food pantry haul for you. This is our county food pantry that allows you to come in twice a month. Once you get to shop, which means you get to pick and choose what you want. And then the other time is what they call Commodities Day, which is the government subsidized items. And you don't shop, they just give you what you get. And that was today. Um, so usually there is some kind of meat, some fresh produce, bread, um, canned items, um, a lot of shelf stable stuff and then usually there's a dairy which there wasn't any today I don't know whether they ran out we weren't there super late but um, it's possible um, so yeah let me show you what we were blessed with over here we have this beautiful big head of romaine and then a nice big bag of carrots I think these are what are called seconds carrots which are just like the ones that are super little or the ones that are up oh, there two carrots in one looks like legs um, a lot of times there's like big chunky carrots, those kind of things. Um, so yeah, I don't mind either way. They taste fine. Uh, there's also two cantaloupe. They had a, a box of very large watermelons when we first got there and they, um, ran out while we were there. So he offered, I could take two cantaloupe because they still had lots of those. They had their baby's shelf, um, still open and, um, they had bunches of these. And so I went ahead and picked up two more boxes of them just as something neat. I still want to try, um, putting some in the freezer and like watching the time and letting them like partially freeze so they get slushy. I just thought that would be a neat, um, way of doing that. But then I also thought that would be good just even in smoothies or something like that. For meat, we got a bag of catfish fillets a can of salmon and a can of pork this stuff is so expensive to buy so i'm always excited to get that and it works so well for casseroles like pulled pork sandwiches that kind of thing um canned goods there are two cans of diced peaches a can of potatoes a can of spaghetti sauce and then two cans of corn um, they also were giving out three cans of green beans but since we have green beans right now i chose to pass on that and save that for somebody else and then there was a gallon of spring water for everybody. There's a bag of in-shell pistachios, which my whole family loves. I don't, but everybody else does, so hey. Um, more dates, which my kids absolutely love these, So, and those are so nice shelf-stable item. Um, you can use these to sweeten things, too, if you're wanting to watch, like, not using... Um, heavily processed sugars, you can sweeten things with those. Like, toss a couple of those in your smoothie, and it sweetens it. You also got to pick two bread items, so obviously there's more than two here, so I will explain. I picked these because this is what I used last Friday to make the pizza crust for the kids, and it worked great, and I was able to make three flat pizzas out of it. And then she asked me, she goes, is this the kind of stuff that you would use? Because she said nobody ever takes them because these are kind of the, like you have to bake them in your oven because they're kind of par-baked. Um, and so she asked me if that was something I would use and I said, yeah. And she goes, by all means, take these because nobody else is going to take them, which means they're going to go in the trash. So I picked up these, or she gave me these, she gave me these three packages of things. These, which I figured I can make those into mini pizzas or, um, use them as sandwiches or dice them up and use them as breadcrumbs or something like that. There's these take and bake French dinner rolls, which same thing. I can use them mini pizzas. We can make like mini sliders or something. And then um, these everything bagel, uh, everything seasoning um, ones that I, once again, I can do them the same thing. I can just cut them open. These would all, like all of these would be great for cutting open, filling them with lunch meat and cheese, um, some mustard, and then baking them like you do with the Hawaiian rolls. Um, but yeah, I may end up doing that for lunch because it's about lunchtime. So that is everything. Um, I was very slightly disappointed to not get any dairy just because that it's always like milk, cheese, even powdered milk. That's all useful, but huge blessing anyway. So, um, yeah, that is everything. A nice short little video for you guys. We will see you another time. Have a great day. God bless. Goodbye.